Hey y'all, welcome back to my channel. My name is Tyla, Tyla around my social channels. If you don't follow me, you definitely should. If you are new here, welcome. Make sure you hit the subscribe button and hit the little bell so you know when I'm uploading another video. I'm so excited for today's video because it is going to be all about SPF and sunscreen. And I know everyone's like, oh my God, Ty, I don't wanna do another step. I don't wanna do this, I do so much already. But y'all, you need to like erase that and like, retract it because you really need to have SPF in your skincare routine. You really need to be putting it on every day. This is so important. You need to protect the skin you're in. You only have one. I feel like, you know, we wash our hair, we put on makeup, we do all these things, but it's like you have to make sure that the skin that you are, you know, out and about frolicking the world with is protected because the sun is very strong and I think that we really forget about it, but as you get older, it is so important and I'm just trying to look 21 when I'm 41 and I know there's a lot of us who feel the exact same. So today I'm gonna go through my top three SPF and sunscreens that I hope will help you guys. They have like changed the game for me. I love them, I use them all the time. I honestly do not leave the house without SPF and I hope you guys take that from this video. So let's just get right into it. So the first sunscreen I'm gonna tell you guys about is the Shiseido Clear Sunscreen Stick, which is literally my best friend, especially in the summer. So first of all, it's super compact literally so tiny palm sized i love that it goes like everywhere with me i throw it in my bag it doesn't feel like an extra step i can apply easily especially over makeup i do this before i leave and then i do it like during the day and my favorite part is that it's actually clear great thing about this like i said is that you can put it under makeup and over makeup so i have makeup on right now and i literally can just put it on my face and go and i use this for like my neck and it's just one of those things that I literally can't leave the house without. It is for all skin types. It is fragrance-free, paraben-free. It's, it's also ocean-friendly. It has wet force and heat force technology so that when you're sweating or you're in the water, it's actually working harder to protect your skin. It's, it's just... It's just an all around great product. And I think like the person who's super lazy and doesn't want to put on SPF is perfect for this because like I said, carry it around with you all day, apply it when you need it. If you know you're going to burn, put it on your face, your ears, your neck. It is just, it's just so like, it's just something that I like. It's become so like staple for me. Um, I also love the lotion, which is like the sister product of it. And I use that all over my body if I'm doing like a beach day. But this for everyday use is honestly clutch. And you guys should literally have this in your bag because it'll like change the game and protect your skin all in one little product. The next SPF sunscreen I'm gonna tell you guys about is a fan favorite. It is the Black Girl Sunscreen, which I heard amazing, amazing things on the internet and I was like, I need to get my hands on this. So about six months ago, I went to Target and I was so excited because they had it in stock and it was $15.99 and we love anything that's affordable and accessible. So I was so excited. Um, I bought it and I tested it out last summer and ever since then I've been hooked. I just love that it just feels so good on the skin. It's like really moisturizing while being SPF 30 and it's for face and it's for body. It's 80 minutes resistant with water. You can go in and out of the beach with it. It never like leaves a white cast or that weird iridescent flashback because it is a chemical sunscreen. So Pro tip, if it is a chemical sunscreen, y'all, it will not leave, you know, like that weird white cast. And I think for me, it was really hard to find a sunscreen that didn't make me look like a gray ghost. So I definitely go like the chemical sunscreen route because it's just so much better, especially for us women of color. It's a struggle to find like products in general, but sunscreen is also really, really hard. Um, what I will say is that a little goes a long way with this. So like, I'm gonna show you guys how it applies, but it is like super moisturizing. And I'm telling you, you can get so much out of like one little use um this is a brand new bottle but my last bottle literally lasted me for like a year and i'm putting on spf every single day um it's also made with avocado oil and jojoba oil and carrot juice so it's really great for the skin and um this is just a really great overall sunscreen y'all and i'm going to show you guys how it applies So as you can see, it has like a nice sheer finish and my skin doesn't feel like nasty or like sticky, which I hate when sunscreens do. So um, definitely if you are on the market for a sunscreen for this summer, y'all, this is 
key, okay? This is, this is amazing. And I told you, you can find it at Target, which we love. So the last of my favorite three sunscreens is going to be a product that's a little different from the last two. It's definitely only for your face, and it is going to be a three-in-one. So it's an invisible SPF, it's a primer, and it's also an anti-aging product, which I think is great because if you know me, then you know that I will pay top dollar for a product that is like a 12-in-one. If it's gonna do all these jobs and all I gotta do is put on one thing, I'm buying it and I'm paying top dollar for it because I'm lazy. It is the Murad Invisibler Perfecting Shield Broad Spectrum SPF 30. And guys, when I found this, I was like, wow, you're really pricey. And then I got home, started using it, and I was like, wow, you're really worth it. So if you are one of the girls that like to wear makeup throughout the summer, this is for you because it is really going to protect and prime and also like make your face look like pores wear. When I'm working or I'm doing a shoot in the summer, like I usually am melting. Like my skin is just like melting because I'm sweaty Betty. But when I use this, y'all, like it really does the justice of a really great primer and blurs out those pores and kind of makes you look like just flawless. So that's why I was like, this is definitely worth the money because it's doing so much in this little tiny bottle. I don't use this every day because I don't wear makeup every day in the summer, but it is definitely worth the investment because it does so much and it's like one product. So I'm like, I'm being protected, I'm being primed, and I'm also like, gonna look younger like I told y'all I'm trying to look 21 when I'm 41 I may not but if I can try to reverse the process I'm all for it so definitely on the more price you're in definitely just for your face but it is something I had to mention because um I just think it's like when it comes to SPF it comes in all different forms and I think people just think SPF I gotta put this whole white blob on my skin and it's not really about that it comes in different forms there's different types for everyone and i hope this video kind of helped you guys distinguish which way you want to go when it comes to applying spf and i hope it helped you guys and i hope you like this video and if you did like it comment like subscribe and i will see you guys in my next one